Now at 10, a national group says there could be something in the water in Madison and more testing is needed. News 3's David Douglas joins us with what some are calling a disturbing discovery, David. We're talking about hexavalent chromium, Eric, a common chemical compound in manufacturing and industrial processes which has been linked to causing cancer. A national research and advocacy group found it and says it's unclear how much is too much to be safe. Water, it's clear and hopefully fresh, but hidden are chemicals you can't see. I mean, just because a chemical is there doesn't mean it's at a dangerous level. Taking a water sample from just one Madison home, the environmental working group found hexavalent chromium, which has been known to cause cancer, at 1.58 parts per billion the fourth highest amount of 35 cities tested. We're raising the issue and saying, listen, we need to look at this more closely nationwide. We're not saying you need to now do something just based on this one sample. We're saying we need to take a closer look at this. This is, this is a big deal. Something like more testing and perhaps additional regulation. So I'm curious what to know. What, if there are federal guidelines, what those guidelines are. Actually, the EPA only requires testing for total chromium, which includes kinds that are good for you. The Environmental Working Group spokesperson says it seems odd a known carcinogen like hexavalent chromium would not be singled out for further review. I think it is. I think if something like this would show up, but it's just, I think it's the city's job to um, address these concerns. And they are. We'll be doing our own research. We're going to try and find out. Uh, uh, we will confirm or, or uh, get a better idea of the accuracy of this uh, environmental working group study. Tom Hakenen heads I Madison's know, water utility. While he doesn't believe a single sample is representative of the entire water system, his staff will be checking anyway. As to how safe city water is, he says one thing is clear. There's nothing that we have that would indicate um, that there is any risk whatsoever uh, in drinking Madison's water. If all of this sounds just a little bit familiar, you might recall the year 2000 film Aaron Brockovich. Julia Roberts starred in the biopic detailing how Brockovich discovered hexavalent chromium was responsible for a high number of cancers and severe health problems of residents in Hinkley, California, and helped them win a historic settlement against Pacific Gas and Electric. The city does plan to discuss this water issue at tomorrow's Water Board meeting. All right, the 19th, David Douglas reporting tonight. David, thank you very much.